Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Big Pharma. I'm Exterminator, and thank you for joining me. So last time we left off, we had uh, created this massive assembly, uh, chain assembly line here, to upgrade our product so we can actually get our level 2 of each of the uh, original two products we were making. And at this point, we're making a decent profit. Um, wow, my keys are like going the wrong direction. Like 164 or whatever time scale that's in and again I know this is a little bit ahead but as you can see it has slowly caught up um, almost so this will push ahead of this one if we continue at this rate now of course the more of this we make um, the less valuable it's probably going to become and these dudes have released like a ton of crap well three so they are ahead of me, but for this particular campaign or mission thing, this isn't, that's not really a problem, that's not the goal. So let's take a look at what we can do here. Last time I did set someone to go explore this. We are almost 50% done. Once we do that, we can unlock, it unlocks the pain medication. Um, so we can start on that. Until then, we don't have a lot we can do. Because we're not even close to being able to get this autoclave to uh, to upgrade this. Um, I mean, let's let's take a look here. Okay, so ooh, now we're making even more money, which is interesting. Somehow, um, did we like finish a re research? No, huh? It's a little strange. Um, let's see here. Okay, so infection medication. Now that's interesting. I haven't actually messed with that before. And it only takes two. So maybe I'll go with this. Psychological medication, I think, is really profitable, at least in my previous experience. Um, so that's definitely one we'll probably want to get if we don't complete the campaign already by then. And last time when I went to research this or explore this, I mentioned that we need this catalyst, and I never really explained what a catalyst is. So. While we wait for this to finish, which will be really quite soon, but pretty much a catalyst is, um, it's a little hard to explain. The catalyst comes with, with an ingredient. Obviously not all ingredients have them. As you can see, only a few things actually unlock catalysts. And there's several different types. I don't believe these are the only two. There's probably more down in these. Um, but, uh, but yeah, a catalyst is, is like part of the ingredient it comes in. And for your more advanced cures, this one might be a good example. You, um, you will need a catalyst for it. And uh, if we actually go like to our dude here and... Um, when was it this guy okay so this one actually doesn't need a catalyst surprisingly and this is like the highest upgraded thing but anyway um, some really more advanced cures like some level threes and stuff and definitely the ones past that will need a catalyst inserted into them to actually um, you know you know get to the active point that you need them to be and the catalyst so that's when it gets kind of interesting because you need a special machine um, called a multi-mixer to mix the catalyst ingredient in with your other part of it so that's why you need those and that part can get pretty complicated so we've unlocked pain it's actually kind of crappy um, <laughs> I thought it would be kind of good but apparently it's not so I think though our profit will suffer I think I'm going to hire another explorer and I'm going to go ahead and explore this I've never messed with infection stuff, so I don't know if that can be that profitable or not. We'll see. Research, we will need to do some of that. I'm a little concerned that'll be too much to pay out. So we do want to keep a profit coming in. And another thing is, while your guys, your research, your scientists or your explorers are idle, like, like not actually doing something, they earn you these points, these upgrade points. And you can use these to upgrade things, which I'm going to do now. I have eight of them because he's been sitting here for a while. Um, 
I'm gonna upgrade this like twice. As you can see down there, pill bonus, it pretty much gives us like three more dollars per pill, which is actually quite significant when you um, combine it with reducing costs of things. And then before I upgrade these, usually what I like to do is take a look at my actual factory here and see what I'm using a lot of. So I see I'm not really using many ionizers, so it wouldn't really be that beneficial to spend points on reducing their um, process cost right now. I do notice I'm using quite a large amount of evaporators and, or sorry, yeah, evaporators. And that's really about it. I'm using a few um, dissolvers and a few agglomerators. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spend at least two points on these evaporators to reduce their cost by process cost by two dollars each. And we have three points left. So I think what I'll do is reduce the cost of that and that. And I mean, I have another point left. I could do it on that. I guess it wouldn't hurt to de de decrease this by a few. But as you can see, this is making a pretty significant impact. We've increased our income by 20 or 25 just by doing this here. And then also with your ingredients. Now our guys haven't really been idle, but we have one point left. And what you can do is upgrade them as well to reduce the, the actual cost of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and reduce the cost of this by 10%, which is four bucks, so that definitely helps. As you can see, that increases our profit even more. So that's definitely something you wanna, you know, not totally forget about, like I have so far, and uh, take advantage of it. And as we can see here, here our bar has actually progressed um, past our, our time bar. And I think it is a good time to unlock some stuff so I'm gonna unlock this one this would probably be a perfect area to do some pain medication if we felt so inclined I think we are catching up to that person too I'd kind of like to see what the infection thing does before we go ahead and start on this the pain thing is really simple and the price actually went up but it has a very low demand um, we should be just about done here. But, uh, but yeah, so let's go ahead. I mean, this one is really quite simple. I just have to get it 7 to 10, and it starts at 13, so I would just need to reduce it by 3, which is pretty simple. Or, wait, sorry. Yeah, maybe. No, this starts at, yeah, 13, right? Okay, so this, our infection, let's see what that allows us to do. Okay, so here is something we probably wanna go for. You can see that Sue's cold symptoms, it's not very profitable, profitable at all, and the demand is really quite low, but if you look at antibiotic we have a hundred two hundred and seventy eight dollars which right now is more than either of these and the demand is a hundred and five which is also more than these so I think we want to head towards this um, that is if we actually have stuff to get to here which we probably do so what I'm gonna do and usually with the catalyst, one thing to mention is it's usually in your negative effect, or it always is. But I think we're going to do this. And for that, I'm actually... Okay, so that's it's a good idea to keep an eye on these. Like, I dig over... It's likely this will scare some people off. That's probably why that kind of took um, a downfall. Okay, so... I doubt we'll be able to get this to stage two over here. I could try. I'm gonna pause the game. I could try. But I think it might not be possible. But we'll see. Because we need to get this to 10. It's at 12. Um, Just by two, so we need two of those. And then...
prerequisites. So actually, I could probably just skip that. Get this to eight. We might have room. Might is <laughs> is the operative word. Okay, so let's go ahead and see what we can do here. Okay, so this guy, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I think I mentioned this in one of my last episodes, kind of what I like to do with some things. The Sousa cold symptom is pretty crappy, as we just saw. However, the antibiotic is good, so I'm just going to skip completely over this and just get this from 12 down to eight. And I'm just gonna do that with one ionizer, because it's one, it saves room, and it does it by three. Now, I'm gonna think here for a minute. I want to try to fit this in um, the best way I can. Moving it over here might be good. And then I'm also going to need one dissolver as well. So, and I don't know, I actually don't know if pausing the game really makes much of a difference. I'm, oh, okay, that's like even better, really. So, I do have to unpause the game to actually get these things to, like, move. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to play on two times speed as much as I can, because I would like to get this mission complete, like, within the next video. Um, okay, so, we're at eight. We have the thing for this. Now we need to upgrade this with an agglomerator. Okay, so we're going to increase the concentration by three, which is interesting. I'd really like to, like, spit this out over here. It's not ideal, but it'll work. And then knowing my luck, well, not my luck, that's how the game is, we're going to need to then probably decrease it. Or only increase it by one, which is actually really quite good. That's actually amazing. And by doing that, we actually get rid of this effect, so that's even better. I'm really pleased with, um, with how this is working out. I am really, really pleased with this. It's not even costing us that much money either. So, I'm just going to... Oh man, this, oh, this is going to be great. Guys, like, damn. Usually it's not this easy. But see, see what I mean um, with the advantage of just entirely skipping a product sometimes? I could have gotten it to Seuss Cold and then done the other stuff you know if that makes sense but I'm just skipping that I'm just going straight from 12 to 8 which is what this needs and then I can directly get that product so our profit went down a bit we're still in the positives but that is totally fine because this bad boy is going to give us um, it's a lot of money. Now, someone did post in the comments in my last video asking for their name to be put in a drug, and I forgot to look at that before I started this, so I apologize. I will look and write that down, and again, if anyone else wants a, um, a cure named after them, you know, post down in the description or comments with what, uh, what name you would like, but you're probably lucky anyway. I don't know if you want an infection thing named after you. But I will get it in the next episode, I promise. So I guess that's good enough. I'd like to see what this gives me profit-wise. And then I'm going to uh, call this an episode, probably. Maybe not, actually. This hasn't taken quite so long as I, uh, as I thought it did. Still have a few minutes. Wow, so we just, like, more than doubled our profit. That is ridiculous. Looks like we're sitting about 360. That is... That is really good. Um, because the, the higher the demand is, that also increases how much it's worth as well. Um, now, if we did have this, we do have this catalyst. And this is like big money right here. If we had this machine here to be able to do that, I would, I would go for that 100%. But... Um, That's like way up here. That's a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Um, I think I'm going to upgrade this one more time. 
and then something else one more time once we uh, get one more point, which we will here shortly. And then I'm going to set one of these guys. I'll need to hire another one. But we're making more than enough money. I'm going to probably upgrade this, actually. That's actually more advantageous. Instead of... Hmm. Yeah, actually, maybe I shouldn't have spent so much on this. Because this only... For these two, that only decreases the cost by one, whereas this decreases it by three. So that's potentially... Well, it is better. So I'm going to hire another guy. It will decrease our profit slightly, but not that bad. And I'm going to head kind of over into this tree. We will need these things eventually. Um... We may actually need this. I'll explain what it does like in the next episode and why we may need it. Because uh, I don't have time to go over that in this one. But I'm going to start with that. And our ingredients. We do have five points actually. So to gain even more profit from what we just did here. I'm going to do this twice to get it down to 20%. $28 per ingredient. I think it was like what like 32 or 34 which is really quite good and uh, I'm not doing anything with this so I don't want that I will upgrade him though and we're still making a very nice profit so we will finish this up in the next video four videos for the first one is kind of long but I did spend some time explaining things and I and I still am but uh but yeah I hope you don't mind that it's four videos for this you know if you enjoy the game and enjoy the videos you probably won't mind and then we will uh, move on to the next one which gets interesting because I believe it actually requires you to make a specific thing like get to a specific cure to complete the thing and it's like a level three or four cure so you have to do a lot of pre-work um, it's a lot more in depth so if we look here 240,000 260 okay so we're not quite catching up Holy shit. <laughs> Gamma erectile function. <laughs> okay, so they're like selling Viagra. Somewhat, pretty much. Um, not very good stuff. Definitely wouldn't want to take that. It is worth a lot. Holy crap. No wonder they're making so much money. Jeez. 718? What is that under? What would that be under? I would think it'd be under body response, maybe? Oh, sexual health, duh. I don't think we can get that for quite a long time. Skin, psychological, blood, yeah. We'd have to research all this crap. Duration plus, is that like another Viagra product? <laughs> Uh, larger and larger quantities of alcohol at ever too price the number of stay-at-home drinkers increases is leading to ever more cases of liver disease and gout which doesn't really affect us we can't do anything with either of those I'd really like to get this but good lord I'm just gonna look at some of this stuff while I close out the video so they're selling two of the like really like do you need to sell two different things come on now Oh, holy shit. So they're actually selling it. It's the same thing, I'm pretty sure. The only difference is one's in a pill form and one's in a cream form. So... <laughs> oh, wow. So with one ingredient, they're getting like double the profit for the cure it would give because they're just putting it in two different forms. That's actually really kind of smart. I believe. I mean... It's like sells for almost the same amount. It's a little more expensive, but that's because it's in a cream form. It does the same exact thing, has the same side effects. So I'd like to see what it induces, but wow. I didn't really think you could do that. I didn't think that. That if you just, all you would have to do is just like split the thing off and have like half of it go to a pill machine and half of it go to a cream thingy. And then you can just get like double the amount of money. That is ridiculous. Huh. I might try to do that with the other thing I just made. Creamer. Hell yeah. 
I think I might try to do that with uh, with this guy here, antibiotic. I don't know if you can put an antibiotic in a cream, but maybe. So yeah, I'm gonna do that. Next video, we're gonna start with that. Um, I'm gonna try to cream some of this stuff too and like do what they did. If they're gonna cheat, I'm gonna cheat. So I think that's gonna be it, guys. As always, thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I do hope you're enjoying. I'm really enjoying myself and uh, you'll finish this up in the next video. So until then, I look forward to seeing you all and take care.